you've never been to Rome before but have been dying to go, here's how you can spend eight hours in Rome to make sure you hit up all the spots. It simply wouldn't be a Rome trip without seeing the Colosseum, so that is definitely our first stop. Our next stop is the Trevi Fountain, and if you want to get good pictures, make sure to get there early. Just to hop in a skip away is the Parthenon. I didn't go in, but you definitely can. From there, we headed to Piazza Navona, which was so beautiful. At this point, you're probably getting hungry, so I would recommend just grabbing a bite and obviously make sure to grab gelato. Your final stop of the day is Vatican City. By this point, your feet are probably tired, you're exhausted, it's hot, humid, you're dying. I really recommend booking a guided tour through the Sistine Chapel and the Vatican Museums. It's the same price as non-guided, so I really recommend it. This was definitely my favorite part of the day, so I highly recommend it. If you have any tips or tricks I missed, let me know and follow for more.